Imagine you're out walking late. You notice you're being followed and you're not sure what to do. If you feel you're in danger, there are the emergency blue lights you can activate. There are 48 of them around campus, and when pressed, an officer with public safety will show up on the scene. In the scenario you're watching, there's three girls walking together, and it's not terribly dark out. That wasn't the case the weekend of September 15th. Early that morning, a student was walking down the steps between the University Union and Kanabla Hall when two men approached her from behind and sexually assaulted her. Campus police caution those who travel late at night to avoid certain areas. When you start taking shortcuts um, uh, through the woods, we have woods around campus, and you start taking those type of shortcuts, those are the places that I would, have, would avoid. Walking outside late is something that some students at Western do regularly. However, the recent event has them being more vigilant. I always look behind me, look in front of me, look to the sides. I just check my surroundings. Um, I always have my phone with me, like holding onto it, so I know if anything happens, I'm ready to like, call 911 or have my phone ready to call my friend or anything. Behind me are the steps between the University Union and Kanabla Hall, and as you can tell, it's a little closed off. Campus OPS says to avoid these kind of areas when walking outside late. Here's some other tips you can use when being out late. Travel in numbers. If you do walk alone, tell a friend where you're going and then contact them when you've arrived. And lastly, program the campus police number in your phone, 309-298-1949. When you call, ask for an escort and someone will walk with you anywhere you need to go as long as it's on campus. And again, be cautious. What looks bright during the day can be very dark at night. For News 3, I'm Chris Lovingood.